2017, astronomers discovered something extraordinary. The interstellar object Oumuamua, which originated in the depths of the Milky Way and entered our solar system. Just two years later, experts identified the next interstellar visitor, Tuai Borisov. And now it has happened again. Experts have once again tracked down a mysterious chunk of matter with three-eye atlas, whose origin lies outside our home system and which is hurtling towards us at an insane speed. But this time, we are ready. While Oumuamua was only discovered when it was already on its way back into interstellar space, 3 Eye Atlas has yet to make its closest approach to the sun. But what have scientists found out about this ominous object? And why does Harvard professor Avi Loeb claim that it could even be the work of a hostile alien civilization? Be sure to stay tuned until the end and find out with us. The Asteroid Terrestrial Impact Last Alert System, or ATLAS for short, is actually designed to detect potentially dangerous asteroids. But from time to time, the Global Telescope Network is also suitable for other purposes, such as adding a groundbreaking entry to the list of interstellar objects in the solar system. On July 1st, an ATLAS telescope in Chile sounded the alarm identifying a celestial body in four images that could potentially pose a threat to our home planet. Immediately afterwards, experts determined that the object had already appeared on several Atlas images in mid-June. But what exactly is approaching? Well, to clarify this, experts are taking a closer look at the orbits of such structures. In the case of the mysterious new discovery, it was quickly determined that it is moving on a highly hyperbolic trajectory, which, and this was the decisive factor, does not bring it closer to our blue home planet. However, the detailed analysis also revealed a spectacular fact. The object, which was initially given the unwieldy name A11PL3Z, does not originate from our solar system. On the one hand, there is the fact that it is hurtling through space at an exceptionally high speed of 60 kilometers per second, much faster than a celestial body that is attracted and held in place by the sun's gravity. And on the other hand, there is the aforementioned hyperbolic trajectory. But what does that actually mean? Well, in simple terms, it means that the interstellar visitor is following a course that is the exact opposite of our native objects. The planets, asteroids, and comets of the solar system mostly move in elliptical orbits around the sun. You could say that they are held captive in our system by the gravitational pull of our host star. In stark contrast, the route of the recently discovered chunk is more like a hyperbola, which means that it dives into our home world, flies through it, and ultimately leaves it again. David Rankin from the Catalina Sky Survey says, it became clear that this object was moving through the solar system on a hyperbolic trajectory. The orbit has an eccentricity of more than six, that's the highest ever observed. The Minor Planet Center at NASA then confirmed the interstellar origin of the intruder and gave it the official name 3i Atlas. Together with Oumuamua and 2i Borisov, we now know of three interstellar celestial bodies that have visited our solar system. And just like back then, the simple but crucial question remains the same. What is 3i Atlas anyway? It's obvious that this question is not insignificant, and it becomes even clearer when we take another brief look at our previous interstellar guests. In the case of 2i Borisov, however, there was unanimous agreement among astronomers. It was clearly classified as an interstellar comet, and that was no surprise, since the stranger, discovered in August 2019, had all the characteristics of a real comet. It consisted mainly of ice and had a characteristic tail. But 2i Borisov was not just any comet. Detailed follow-up observations showed that its surface appeared astonishingly intact, and that it was even more pristine and unaltered than any known comets in our solar system. However, the emphasis in this case really lies on the word was. Although the passage of the sun was probably the first time the chunk had ever encountered a star, it did not survive unscathed, breaking into two pieces as a result of the sun's heat. But regardless of whether it broke apart or not, a comet is still a comet. And, of course, the experts would have liked to be able to give a similarly precise assessment of Oumuamua. 
but they simply couldn't. Discovered in October 2017 by the Pan-STARRS telescope in Hawaii, we still cannot say with absolute certainty what actually entered our home system at that time. In short, this is because Oumuamua is something of a prime example of a cosmic mystery. It had neither a tail nor a coma, in other words, a comet shell, and also confused researchers because no dust was found in its vicinity. What we do know, however, is that Oumuamua apparently has the shape of an oversized cigar and that it accelerated mysteriously as it moved away from the sun. Specifically, this refers to the fact that it flew slightly faster than the pure influence of gravity would have allowed. In principle, we're familiar with the process of outgassing of volatile components, which can give celestial bodies a natural boost in speed. But this is usually accompanied by dust formation and a significant change in rotational behavior. However, since neither of these phenomena could be detected in Oumuamua, wild speculations about its true origins soon arose. And not just from creative minds on the internet, but also from renowned Harvard professor Avi Loeb. He claimed that the interstellar visitor met all the criteria one would expect of an artificial solar sail and put forward the controversial theory that we might have been targeted by an extraterrestrial civilization for research purposes. And indeed, the radio telescope at the Green Bank Observatory subsequently searched specifically for possible signals of artificial origin, but ultimately came up empty-handed. And so it is that most scientists now believe that Oumuamua was simply a comet that formed a tail of invisible hydrogen gas, which gave it an extra boost of speed. Okay, but what about 3i Atlas? Could we be dealing with an extraterrestrial spacecraft this time? Well, according to Avi Loeb, at least in theory, it's not out of the question. But more on that later. The initial estimates are a little less far-fetched, suggesting that 3i Atlas could have a diameter of up to 24 kilometers, although the more realistic predictions are in the region of around 5 kilometers. However, when it comes to the question of what it is, the findings so far indicate that it is probably a comet. Some astronomers have already discovered a short tail and a kind of comet shell, and its origin also supports the comet theory. But that's not all. Its origin also suggests the exciting conclusion that we have caught a genuine Methuselah. A 7 billion year old visitor. 3i Atlas is currently located between Jupiter and Mars. As a result, it is still around 670 million kilometers from the Sun and will reach its perihelion, the point in its journey closest to the Sun, in October. The rendezvous with our source of heat and life will also mark the turning point of its cosmic route. And now, analysis of that route has shown that the chunk probably originates from the thick disk of the Milky Way. This region is located above and below the thinner main plane of our home galaxy and mainly contains very old stars. And that's exactly the point. The environment surrounding these stellar elders in the thick disk is often rich in ice, which is why experts suspect that 3i Atlas is a water-rich comet. And as befits such an ancient home, the comet could also be extremely old. More precisely, it could have formed as long as 7 billion years ago, making it 2.4 billion years older than the Sun. Astrophysicist Chris Lintott from the University of Oxford says, This object comes from a part of the Milky Way that we have never seen up close before. We estimate the probability that this comet is older than our solar system to be two-thirds. And his colleague Matthew Hopkins adds, Our statistical methods suggest that 3i Atlas could be the oldest comet we have ever seen. And if anyone knows about the age of such celestial bodies, it's Hopkins. After all, as part of his doctoral thesis, he developed an analysis model that can be used to narrow down the age and characteristics of interstellar objects based on their orbits and possible regions of origin. And as luck would have it, the so-called Otatahi Oxford model was completed a week before the discovery of 3i Atlas, and Hopkins says, It's a fantastic opportunity to try out our model on something so new and yet so ancient. And the same goes for Avi Loeb, who is now testing his ancient alien theories on this brand new discovery. Specifically, he and his colleagues have published a paper arguing that 3i Atlas could be the work of an alien civilization, much like Oumuamua. After all, 
the object is moving at a speed of 220,000 kilometers per hour, which is significantly faster than its two interstellar predecessors. In addition, its orbit is retrograde, or in other words, opposite to the planetary orbits and lies almost in the ecliptic, the plane of the planetary orbits. Furthermore, the scientists emphasize that 3I Atlas comes suspiciously close to Venus, Mars, and Jupiter, and they estimate the probability of this being a mere coincidence at just 0.005%. The researchers also put forward the so-called Dark Forest Hypothesis, which states that extraterrestrial civilizations deliberately keep themselves hidden in order to avoid being wiped out by a hostile species. Without concrete evidence, however, these far-fetched explanations remain pure speculation, and Loeb's group is well aware of this, of course. In detail, the authors even explicitly emphasize that their paper should not be understood as a potential discovery of a spaceship, but simply as, quote, an educational exercise, a thought experiment that serves to sharpen our scientific methodology. In the near future, however, the astronomers will first sharpen their scientific gaze. Some of the world's largest telescopes are already trained on the new interstellar object and should soon clarify what it is and what it consists of. And if you don't happen to have one of the world's largest telescopes at home, there's no need to be sad. 3I Atlas could also be visible to amateur telescopes in late 2025 and early 2026. And if you look just below our video, you should see the subscribe button. Simply click on the thumbs up and then subscribe to never miss another post from us. See you soon.